Previously on Alan Wake, I wrote a horror story that has come true. Thomas Zane did the same in the 70s. You will go no further. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story. No one will survive. You knew Zane, Thomas Zane. You're the Lady of the Light in the song. He left something behind to help me, the clicker. Alan thought of this as he stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, the clicker in his hand. He took a deep breath and jumped. I can get to her now. I can finish this. Episode 6, Departure. Hey there, everybody. Uh, oh, New York City. Two years ago. Uh, it's been a, uh, at least a little more than a month since I've played this. Maybe even around a month. It's been a while. Explode and the light hurt my eyes. I needed my sunglasses and painkillers to dull the pain. In one of my finer moments of self deception, I swore to quit drinking. Huh. Wow. He looks. He looks very, uh, not okay. The, 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 uh, uh, the sunglasses made the world look bearable. Oh yeah. Now I could keep look my at eyes that. open without feeling like a vampire in the sun. I mean, <laughs> the way that you look, dude, it's not helping. Oh, I can't go in here. What a shame. I haven't played this I game in a while. Sure I'd make it out there without some painkillers. Oh, oh. Anyway, uh, it's been a while since I played this game. And I'm remembering why I disliked uh, the camera. Because the camera sucks. The prospect of being awake started to seem bearable again. Yeah. I'm totally cool. There was uh. a message waiting for me on the machine. Yeah? Well, you're gonna have to wait. Uh. Oh, look at me. Alan Wake on top of the world, bruh. Come on, ma, look at me. Alright, I don't know what I'm doing. God, this camera is so unbearable. Oh, oh, oh. You have one new message. Ow! Are you still asleep? Is that Barry? Wakey, wakey! You should have your show on your table. If Alice wasn't too mad to record it. Yeah, she called me earlier and really chewed me out. Yeah, yeah, we went a little overboard last night. But parties are a part of this business. Yes. Now, look, I'm saying this as your friend. She's not doing your career any favors by trying to run your life like that, okay? Oh. I'll talk to you later, Al. Watch the show. Okay. I'm gonna watch the show. Uh. That is some HD quality right there. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. We have a great show tonight. I've been talking with the best-selling author, Alan Wake, about his new book, The Sudden Stop. Yeah, good read. Go buy it. <laughs> I'm so funny. Uh, I'm going to be honest here. Is that wise? No, but I'm going to do it oh. anyway. I got people who give me the lowdown on books. I'm a busy guy. But this one, I actually read from cover to cover. I mean, I'm a, I'm a big fan. Wow. Wow, thanks. Now, this might be a spoiler for those who haven't read the book yet. Based on the sales figures, the two people out there who haven't read the book yet. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck are those two people doing? Of the main character, the hard-boiled New York detective, Alex Casey. Now, there's been a lot of outrage about this. Why the hell did you kill Casey? What the hell were you thinking, man? Good riddance. <laughs> no, seriously, though. No. Seven years and six books is a long time. He was a gloomy guy to spend all your working hours with, and it was a good run. But it's time to explore new things. My next book will be a departure from the old for me. You selfish bastard. Always thinking of yourself. Um. Well, you've certainly given us a lot of entertainment over the years. Yeah. Okay. Hey, now that you mention it, Casey was a gloomy guy. Never had much luck with his love life with the ladies. 
out. Am I right? Autobiographical in any way? Yeah, no kidding. Ooh. With Casey, it was all about his pain. No, nothing autobiographical about that. I'm a happily married man. My wife is my muse. Well, congratulations. That's great to hear. So, how's the publicity tour been treating you? Um, Good. Great. So am I just? Say, I'm glad to be am I just watching this? Well, you've certainly been on the news a lot lately. Lots of parties and um. You got it to a fight with <laughs> oh my god, crazy. game! That is oh, horrible. Man. Well, that guy was really in my face. I lost my temper. I know that wasn't cool. Uh, you are famous for that temper. <laughs> well, I did also write several books. <laughs> <laughs> well, that totally excuses called, your violent stop. behavior. It's in bookstores now. Go get it. That means the two of you out there who haven't bought it. Yet. Yeah, if you don't, I'll beat the crap out of you. We have for you tonight. I want to thank all our guests for the evening. Alan Wake, Sam Lake. What's more, do the who's for Sam? <laughs> who's, who's Sam Lake? Guests, poets of the fall. Thank you. Oh, good. At least I've been funny. I told myself I could live with that. Hey, honey. Can you watch the show? I didn't say anything stupid, if that's what you want to know. Okay, Grumpy. You want to ask him something? Are you going to start with me about drinking now? You know what? Go back to sleep, Alan. Hey, come on. Don't do that. Damn. What? Now you can't even talk to me? Well, this morning I was angry because you said you'd be home at midnight and you showed up at 7 a.m. and passed out in mid-sentence. Now I'm over it. Are you angry? This goddamn tour. It's gotten out of hand. Oh, honey. It's almost over, right? We can get back to normal. Then you can start writing again. I'm sorry, honey. Alan, you're not thinking straight. Just take a shower and go back to bed, huh? Yeah, you're right, honey. I'm sorry. Once this is over, let's go away together. A vacation. To yeah. And May. Some peace and quiet. Let's do it two years later and then have you disappear while we just start the trip. The present day. Somehow, the clicker was the key to the cabin. I had to return to Cauldron Lake to save Alice. Okay. I'm going back to the lake to finish this. I'm going to write an ending to the story in the manuscript on my own terms, to make it all right. Yeah. Why can't you just write it here? The last page is still in the typewriter. I need to read it first. Everything needs to be just right. Zane tried to cut some corners, and it didn't end well. Okay, ready when you are. All I'm right. sorry, Sarah, but I need to do this alone. What? Barry, take her gun. What? What? Why? Miss Weaver, close the door when I leave. <laughs> Barry's like, hey, I got a gun. Aw. Good luck, Al. See you later. You didn't have to take her gun. Like, just say, no, I gotta do this alone. Sunny. Yeah. I'd flick the switch of the clicker. Had it done this? I didn't stop to question it. I had to take advantage of the sunlight to get to the lake. On Zane's page, I'd stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, about to use the clicker. That's where I was headed. Yeah. And then we'll all get a cheese pizza. All right, okay. It's a little weird, Alone, but okay. In daylight, surrounded by the beauty of the Pacific Northwest yeah. landscape, it was hard not to let doubt creep in one last time. I could still chalk everything up to a dream, a delusion. I had enough imagination to make up something like this, having been in the cabin all this time, trapped in a story inside my head, gone mad from grief over Alice's death like Hartman had claimed. There would be no way of knowing. I told myself, it didn't really matter. My course was set. Look at me. I'm white trash. <laughs> uh, uh, look at that product placement. Verizon. <laughs> Here's what I think about your 
billboard Verizon. Uh. All right, I should probably drive on the right side of the road. It is daytime. Or, because I'm going to be leaving this town soon. <laughs> I am on this side of the road. <laughs> no one can stop me. I should turn on the radio or something. There's no one on the road. Um. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? This is deliberate. The game's doing this on purpose. The darkness had touched me. There was Ew. a link between us. Always would be. I could feel its presence again, getting closer. I was gonna turn to night time as soon as I... Ugh. Yep, knew it. Kill your wife. Oh, that's not nice. So, um, that didn't go well. Yeah, it's night time. So, did I black out? Or, I mean, my car is not there. Ooh, manuscript. Hello. Let's see what that has to say. The Dark Presence wants to stop waiting. The Dark Presence was no longer trying to capture the writer so he could create the ending it wanted. The writer knew too much. He was too strong. And he carried a weapon left behind by Thomas Zane, something that could hurt it. Now, the darkness was doing everything in its power to simply stop the rider from ever reaching Cauldron Lake and the dark place it came from. Yeah. It's, uh, getting spooky. Oh, great. It's alright. I got this car right here. I can take it. I'm just taking this vehicle. I don't like those logs being there. Is, is there another car? Oh. Alright. More cars. Don't like this. Oh my god! Hey! Sir, get out of the way! Sir! Sir! Oh my god, I just hit someone! Oh no! Oh shoot. Maybe there's some stuff here I can take. Just want to look through here really quick. Hope the game doesn't mind. Oh, I can go in here. Alright, sweet. Based on the signature in the motel register, Agent Nightingale had stayed here, in room number two. Yeah. Sucks for him. The Majestic Hotel. General information. Refundable $100 security deposit is required on all reservations. No personnel checks accepted. We take all major credit cards and bank cards. Checkout time is 10 a.m. No loud music, no pets. One vehicle per unit. Facilities are for registered guests only. No visitors are allowed on the premises after 9 p.m. No exceptions. We hope you enjoy your stay at the Majestic. If you're a senior or a vet, ask about our discounts. Oh. Place feels weird anyway. Oh, hello. Hello. Number two. Oh. This had obviously been the room where Agent Nightingale had stayed when oh, he had been busy harassing me. <laughs> oh, yeah, I can stick and tell. Some revolver ammo. A flashbang. I hope uh, the FBI agent doesn't mind me stealing 
some stuff from him. Look after yourself and your ha! Damn. See, now this I'm not scared of. Resident, e Resident Evil 2, I'm frightened of because of that giant freaking tyrant dude. We That was epic. But uh, yeah, this I'm not that terrified in. Uh, I'm th this is all right. Oh Jesus. Oh my god. I take that bitch. Um guys, come on, seriously. This now is not the time. Oh boy, time for my dumb running. It leaves me out of breath. Okay, can't. I cannot go this way. Guess I'm going the way on the bridge. Come on, gotta catch my breath, cause you know I run out of breath every two freaking seconds. It's so bright. Things are, things are gonna become shadows, aren't they? Oh, hello, flare. What's that shine? That's kind of loud. What the hell? Yeah, what, what the hell? Oh, come on. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Well, um... Maybe I shouldn't have gone on that side. Gonna pick that up again. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. Oh, Jesus. What the hell? Oh, what the hell? Excuse me, hope you don't mind. Okay. Ow. I'm gonna die. Like that. Whoa. Uh. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Oh my god, he's out of fucking breath! I hate, I hate Al Alan. You are the worst fucking person to ever rely on. God, this game is so horrible with its running mechanic. Like, you run out of breath. And what the hell is this? Okay, okay, okay. Wow. I, I'm literally stuck in place here. Something. It's all dark. There we go. <laughs> um, alright. I don't know what the hell that meant, Alan, but alright. Please, can I take this car? Can I steal this car? Can I take it? Can I drive it? Oh, thank heavens. No, come on. Stupid ass. Stupid. Haha. <laughs> what the fuck? Dude, now is not the time to play games with me, alright? I'm in the middle of driving. Out of the way. Shit. Um, um. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Yeah. Everything is all blurry. I can't see Jack Baloney. Alright. I'm fine. This is fine. I'm okay. Oh no. Oh no. Well, sh shit. Uh -huh. Oh god. 
cool. That was some driving. Oh, hello. Palm shotgun. Yeah. Okay, we're done, Shadows. You done causing a ruckus? Okay. I guess I'll take... Can't take this car? Alright, whatever. These flares. I take this car. No, I cannot. Nice. Double the shadow goop gone. Can't take this truck. Cleaning up the streets, don't worry about me. Ah, son of a bitch. Hope so much for helping out the streets. Mmm! Take that, bitches. Come on. <laughs> eh, stupid ass shadows. Eh. Oh shit, it's a grenade! Jump! And that did not work at all. That was not epic. Hey guys. Oh shit. Ooh. Oh wait, there's some guy over here. Hey buddy. Alright, dude, not cool. You wait your turn to get killed. There we are. Let's read this manuscript. Let's take a break from the creepiness. The bottom of Cauldron Lake was a graveyard of things the lake had claimed in one way or another over Is this the kind of spoiling things? The dark presence brought them up in its wake, scattering the rotten waterlogged hull of an old boat here. The remains of a long ago craft airfield there. Trees shattered under the impacts. The earth groaned. It didn't even notice. Huh. That's so dark. Oh, speaking of. Oh, thank you. There's a car. <laughs> yeah. Alright, now we can go on a nice peaceful drive to the lake. Oh, the freaking Verizon billboard. I don't care. Yoink! I disobey the law. What are you gonna do about it? Ah, oh, come on! Shoot. Uh, hold on a second. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on, game. game. Let me get up the roof. Come on. Rocks. Yeah. Time to cheat the game. Ah! <laughs> yes! Look at that. I cheated the game. Am I not the greatest person of all time? I surely am so smart. How, how am I not dating like 90 women at the same time? I have a bad feeling about this place. Oh my god! You thought you could scare me? <laughs> Idiot. Okay, well you did actually frighten me, so... I had to get the game. Oh. Stupid idiot. You thought you... Oh, Jesus, I can't see. You thought you could get me? 
Well, you couldn't. Anything important here? No? Then what's the point of this? Ooh, there's some goodies over there, but I don't need to get them at the moment. I just want to open up this damn gate. Alright. I mean, I could try and find my way to jump over it. Come on. Ah. Come on. No, wait. Alright, no game. Hold on. No? Alright, game will not let me jump. Through... Wait a second. Nope, can't get in this truck. I swear to God, I thought that was a freaking machine gun for a second. Oh, hello, Thermos. Batteries. It's very quiet in here, which I don't like. I'm gonna lower the game volume on my headphones just a little bit. Only because when the game does that like quote unquote jump scare thing with the the shadows, it like bl blasts the jump scare music and my uh Oh. Oh, son of a gun. Hey there. Well, while I'm here. You hear that? I hear that too. Something's going on. Is it down there? Are there shadow people waiting for me? Oh, I did not. I didn't want to use the flashbang. Whatever. Alright, let's get the heckity heck out of here. Hey there, buddy. Oh. Woo! That was, that was kind of cool. Yeah! Where do I go now? Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I know what you're trying to do, game. Game, you can't trick me. You're gonna make this guy come to life when I turn that thing on to remove that up. I've played enough of this game to know what you're doing. Which means, what am I doing leaving the car all the way right there? I'm so stupid. I'm gonna park. All the way right here. I had to get the container out of my way. There had to be a way to power up the oh. container lift. Oh, you little... Fine, 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 hurry up. Oh, hello. Good stuff. Oh, manuscript page. Let's read that. Thomas Zane's last drive. Zane cut its heart out, but it didn't die. The thing that wore Barbara's face kept crooning sweet nothings sugar-laced with poison. He put on the suit, untied the monster from the chair. The thing in his arms thrashed weakly, but he held fast. He stepped outside off the pier and into the dark water a sinking pinprick of light descending toward a bottom that never came hmm. what a shame oh pretty light Ooh, look at all this ah oh, such good shit uh. Wait, whoops sorry hold on uh. Uh, and joint. Joint. Yeah, but now that I turn that on, which means, uh, come up. Come up. Just really hoping I could sneak around that. 
Alright, let's get this over with. Wait. Why was it? Sh oh my god! Stop it. You're, you're gonna turn alive, I know it. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. Take your time, man. Don't worry. It's all right. Just, just take 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 your time. Oh. Jesus. I don't know why the hell I went alone. This is ridiculous. I am... I don't like being alone in these kind of games. They make me nervous. And they make me talk to myself a lot. I never talk to myself. Oh, hold on a second. Hello? I can't pick up any more ammo. Wait. And a good show. Oh, no, I can't. All right, whatever. When I told Barry my plan back in the well-lit room, I'd acted as if I knew what I was doing. I didn't. I was operating on the shifting logic of a dream. I had to fight my way to the lake through the horrors of the night. I had to flick an old battered light switch imbued with childhood magic. I had to write a happy ending to a horror story. I had to save my wife from the dark prison she was being held in. I mean, you're also being controlled by a video game character. Oh, oh my god, click! Click hard! Oh. Yeah. Mm hmm. It's okay. I kind of clicked a lot more than I thought I would. Oh no. Oh no. I don't like this. Oh. What a pretty bird. Anyway, gotta stay focused. I will never give her to you. Gee, thanks, game. Oh. Well, that's something. Just gonna. Yeah, load the music, load the effects, load the speech, load the cinematic. There we go. Alright, I'm good now. Uh... so smart I should date myself but no all of you should date me <laughs> come on keep pushing baby you're good at this you're really good at this yeah oh god Ooh, I dodged that Ooh. okay so I don't go up here the flip do I go? Oh, hello. Wait, hold on. I gotta pick up a menu skip page first. Before you kill me. <laughs> Ooh, right before you could hit me? Oh. Oh, shoot. Oh, I gotta keep pushing. Right? No? I don't know what I gotta do then. What do I... What? Oh. Oh, oh, God. Ow. All 
Alright, bro. Not nice. Ah! Damn it. Come on. Woohoo! Oh my gosh. See Mirror Peak in the distance. Oh, wow. That's where Cauldron Lake yeah. was. Man, I've never had to do this trying to get freaking over there before. This game is making things so extra. Okay, cool. I think I'm good. Oh. Oh, no. Come on. Come on. I'm not, I, I know I can get in. Yeah. All right, time to go on a fun ride. Oh, I see those. <laughs> Stupid birds. Oh shit. All right, well, back to nothing. Oh, jeez. Ah! Climb. What for? Isn't that where I gotta go? No, gotta go up here. All right, guess I'm going up here. I think I didn't see those birds face through uh, that uh, little fence there. I noticed it. Wait, what am I doing? Oh. Well, shoot. Okay, okay. Nice try, game. You were, you were trying to trick me. You were going to make me push that and then I was gonna be stuck over here you think I'm dumb oh yeah think I'm stupid uh. nice oh shit what, what wait a minute oh so I have to push that Oh, that's that's a little silly game. That's a little silly. All right, let's just do this again. Cue the it birds. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. You know, I thought I was using the goddamn revolver. Alright, I'm so confused. What do I do now? Eh. Wait, so then, what was, what was the point? I jumped over here before. Oh my gosh. Oh, hello, Thermos. All right, so all that was pointless. Ah! God, guys, cut it out. 
cut, cut it out. Really, guys? Not cool. Only frickin' 47 minutes in. And I think I still got another, like, half hour. 40 minutes to go. Oh man. Oh, hey, guys. <laughs> nice try, sucker. here. Guess I can go on my way. Alright, so, so far, um, we've had a lot of things thrown at us. We've had, uh, birds that can fly through gates. Uh, we've had that crazy old lady that loves to try, try to jump scare us. We've had noises that just go bang right in my ear. And we've got that. Hold on. I'm not in the mood, Frank. I see a little generator. Nice try. Uh, 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 oh shit. Uh, uh. Oh. How beautiful. I'm getting all the shotgun ammo, but um I love yeah, hunting rifle ammo, thank you. Oh nope, go over here. Keep forgetting about the map. Okay, cool. Oh, really? Again? Stop giving me the goddamn hunting rifle! I wish I could hide from me. Let's try it. Oh, Jesus. Alright. Let me just get my stuff in here really quick, alright? <laughs> Stop trying to freaking hide. I'm fine, whatever. I'm just gonna keep running. I'm gonna bring these flashbangs with me. All right, bitch. All right, you know that's it. Damn. Hey! Seriously? Still? I know you're hiding. You're a coward. Ha 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 ha. 
Yeah, that's right. Run away and hide. Run to mommy and daddy. Oh my god! Ha! You fell from my trap! I wanted to get scared by whatever that was. I hear that. I heard those footsteps. You you cannot trick me. No matter what you try to do. So much freaking shotgun ammo, but can you give me a shotgun then? At least let me carry the shotgun as well. Son of a bitch. Where are all these things coming from? I know they ain't coming. There's no way all this is coming from the sky. Like, this is. This is no bueno. Alright, alright. Jesus. Maybe this is how we can bring the Titanic back. Alright, that was not a good joke. That was a bad joke. Not even funny. Come on, Pat, you're better than that. I mean, are you? Oh my god, I knew it. I heard someone running up towards me. Stop it! That was not cool. It's giving me freaking flashbacks of Resident Evil 2 and the freaking tyrant guy chasing after me. I'm hearing his footsteps everywhere. I refuse to play that game for a while because of that. I will not... I will admit, I am a full-on coward when it comes to stuff like that. When a horror game does that to me, I will chicken out. I am not afraid to admit it. Oh. The darkness was... he. I can't read any of that. You're in the deep breathing, which means there's something. Nope, here we go. Nice, nice, nice. Very cool. Alright, I'm almost six... I'm, I'm, I'm all, almost an hour in. I'm gonna take the freaking shotgun back. Look at all that ammo I have. The darkness controls the taken. Oh, you can say that again, sister. Eh. Well, that was not cool. Twink a twink a twink a twink a twink. I needed to get the generator running. Of course. Where is it? I'm watching you. I know you're gonna try something with me. Oh, there's no generator in here. So then where is it? Is it in here? Or is there a shadow monster? Neither, but I got a flashbang. I see the generator. Boink, 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 boink. Uh. 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 And on. And now a whole bunch of shadow shit is about to show up. Yeah. 
Don't even try coming near me. Come on, do it. Come near me. See what happens. I'm epic. Come on, come towards me. See what happens. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> if, I, <laughs> if, if I was going down, I was going to take him with me. Yoink. Alright, let's do it. Yep, I know. Things activated. Bad. Whew. Oh God! Ow! No! Don't even fucking think about it, buddy. Run! Run! Oh Jesus! Come on! Health, please help me. Okay, cool. Thank you. Oh my god, this is slow. Oh my goodness. Okay, bring me up there. Oh, thank god. Health. Oh, such beautiful help. And, and, and it's gone. Great. La la la. Turn back now. You keep showing me the same shot. It's just gonna make me want to go and do more of this. All right, hold on a second. You go right there. You go right here. Cheated the system. God. Do as you're told. No. I'm an American. I do the opposite of what I'm told. Wait, hold on. I gotta stop for a second. Alright, cool. Oh, not Okay, so I never God, stop doing that You're not helping <sighs> Okay, alright Oh my goodness gracious Well, this wasn't on the brochure. Ow. Come on. If I pick up all this flare gun ammo, oh jeez, I got so much flare gun ammo. You will fail. Mm. It's all in your head. You're 
I mean, you're probably right, actually. Tornado Wrangler. <laughs> Why would you drop that? Don't do that. You may need it. the end of the episode. <gasps> I never Shane, left New York. You were having a bad dream. It was just another nightmare. No. Everything's no, that, fine. that's a You're great fine. name for a sequel. It wasn't a dream. Everything's fine. Ooh, hey, Turn Alice. The Turn the lights on! What? Shh, baby. The power's out. There's no light. Come back to bed and I'll make you forget all about your fear in the dark. Oh, man. It's your fear. Why aren't you afraid? You're not Alice. Turn the lights on now. Yeah. The clicker. What did you do with it? Alan. Yeah. You're still one foot in a dream. You're not making any sense. Come back to bed. God, I wish. But no. No. I'm walking away. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? No, I'm gonna go in my office and I'm gonna write. No, not Dr. Hartman. He sounds way too much like that Carter Peter Schmidt fella. Departure is your best work yet. Oh, thanks. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Come back to bed. We'll talk more about it in the morning. Yeah, no. Yeah, I told that bitch. Oh god damn it! Come back to bed, Alan. Come back to bed, Tom. Oh, Ew. The fuck was that? You must find your way to the cabin. How? It stands in your way. It won't let you pass. No heart. It's filled with what am I, Bioshock? You must fill its heart with light. Don't mind him, he's Mr. Scott. Your friends will meet him when you're gone. Oh? Alan Wake, I'm such a big fan. Use the clicker. Hmm. The hell? Ooh, hell yeah. Thermos. Barrel. Oh. Phone. Shopping cart. Huh. Who are you? What have you done with my Alice? Alice? What are you doing? Put the light 
back on. What are you doing, Alan? Stop. Put the light back on. It wasn't true. Nothing like that had ever happened. Uh huh. You're not my Barbara. Tom, let me go. I promise to be good. Please, untie me, you naughty Ugh. boy. I will help you write your masterpiece. I will love you forever. No, you're not Barbara Jagger. I made a terrible mistake. I should have never written you back. You came back wrong. Your heart is filled with darkness. Put that knife away, Thomas. Put it down. Cut it out. Ugh. Well, uh, filled with darkness. This is something. Get away from me, you hag. Where am I? Let me go. <laughs> Alice, 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 Alice. Your husband refused to do as he was told. All he had to do was write what I wanted him to write. No, 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 no. For, forget your your words. All right. Get her back. Oh, I missed your your other voice. I am much older than you. Yeah, I can tell. Older than your first work of art. I will find a new face to wear. Uh, someone else to dream me free. I guess you could say I had a bright idea. <laughs> oh, Alan did not like that joke. Presence close by. I understood what I had to do now. I knew how to write the ending to departure. There's light and there's darkness. Cause and effect. There's guilt and there's atonement. Yes. But the scales always need to balance. Everything has a price. That's where Zane had gone wrong. There's a long journey through the night back into the light. Oh, no! <gasps> Gotta save her, man. Seem a little shaken up over something. Oh. Alan? Alan? Oh, that's not fair.
Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't tell me that's it. <laughs> no. That's not the end. No. Oh, what's going on here? <laughs> this. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> we weren't even a big part of the game! <laughs> I don't even know who I am. <laughs> I don't know who I am. Haha, <laughs> we're Thor and Odin. We're, we're better in Marvel. Oh, it's her. Um, what's that guy behind her? Ew, that's weird. Damn it. Uh, that is it. Oh, so, oh, 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 oh. Can I skip through this? Yes, I can. Um, well, that was something. Okay. My thoughts. I really like the concept of this game. I love the story. I love the characters. And I liked um, the, the bad guy, even though we didn't really know much about her. We, we learned enough about her and what the shadows are supposed to represent and stuff. I like all of that. The gameplay was atrocious most of the time. I hated the running mechanic. You ran out of breath every 10 seconds. It'd be one thing if like, I could run for 20 seconds, I'm out of breath for like five seconds, and then continue on. But like, it, 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 I would never have a chance to actually run away uh, from enemies. Enemies would either hit me once, or hit me three times or two times, and like they would just continue coming after me no matter what. The camera angle was horrible. I, I hate that kind of camera angle. They do that same thing in the freaking Batman Arkham games and, and other games. I hate it. They're terrible. I don't think they're good camera angles. Other than that, I liked this. I, I, I actually did. I thought it was a fun game. It spooked me a few times. Um, I'm 100% sure there's more to this. My friend Ashley... Uh, who's been getting me into the game for a long time. She told me about it, told me to play it. Um, you know, Ashley, if you're watching this, I hope you enjoyed my um, nightmare. <laughs> That's the name of another game. Um, I'm going to try and talk to her to see if there's anything more about this, because I feel like there's more that could be done, probably. I mean, I didn't collect all the pages, so maybe that helped. I don't know, but... There's a lot of unanswered questions, so I thought it was kind of funny how the entire town celebrated as soon as uh, Alan was uh, gone, or whatever. So yeah, I guess that's it for now. See you guys next time.